Jordan Baker, the famous sporting star, golfer. <laughs> oh, I, I see. I've spotted him. Thank you. What kind of game are you and Gatsby playing at? The gentleman will be Excuse joining. Me, one moment. Nick, please, well, it's all rather strange. Down. He picks me up in his fancy yellow car and he's going on and please on about his life and the war and. People can hear you. What is this enormous request? He Jordan, wants you to invite Daisy to tea. Daisy? And Gatsby? Why? I don't quite know where to start. You see, I didn't realize until the other night that. I'd met Gatsby five years ago in Louisville. It was the day I got my new English golf shoes. Daisy was by far the most popular girl with the officers from Camp Taylor. Hello, Jordan. One of them was in the car with her. It was Gatsby. And the way he looked at her is the way all girls want to be looked at. So, tell me what happened. Well, I don't know. Gatsby was sent off to war. When the war ended, Daisy waited. But for some unknown reason, Gatsby couldn't return. A year later, Tom Buchanan of Chicago swept in and stole her away. He gave her a string of pearls worth $350,000. The morning of the wedding, Daisy received a letter. Tell them Daisy's changed her mind! What is this? Please! No! Livio! No one must know about well, What was in the letter? I don't know. She wouldn't tell me. But it was too late. That day at 5 o'clock, Daisy Faye married Tom Buchanan with more pomp and circumstance than Louisville had ever seen. <laughs> After the honeymoon, I saw them in Santa Barbara. Well, it was touching, really. I'd never seen a girl so in love with her husband. A week later, Tom crashed his car. The girl with him is a chambermaid at the Santa Barbara Hotel. It got into all the papers. It's a strange coincidence. What is? The fact that Gatsby's house is just across the bay. It's not coincidence. He bought that house to be near her. He threw all those parties, hoping she'd wander in one night. He constantly asked about Daisy. I was just the first person that knew her. All that for a girl he hasn't seen in five years. That, and now he just wants me to invite her over to tea. The modesty of it. Kind of takes your breath away.